I watched that video of you finding out that Shanann was pregnant. You don't seem excited. You seem like kind of in shock Scared. and yeah, like oh fuck. Like well, it's, it's already complicated and now this. Well, it's like uh when we had talked about it, like a couple weeks, it happened fat like with Bella. It was like we almost gave up mm -hmm. trying. And then she bought me like a supercharger for my car. And then with Cece, it was like we had to try and try and try. And then finally, but with Nico, it was you know once or twice, and then like two weeks later, she's pregnant. Is that what happened? Yes. Huh. And just like it was more of like surprise, scared. I'm like, wait, what? Like we just we just we just, we just talked about this, <laughs> like. You know, you know, people have brought up the fact like, oh, she, she was probably pregnant before, like you guys even talked about it. I'm just like, no, it's just not, it's not, no. But like, yeah, it was insanely fast. I give it that. Like, that's the only reason I ever gave that notion, like, even the moment of thought, because it was like faster than any other time that she, she'd gotten pregnant. You just didn't seem happy. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I, I haven't like, I don't remember the video much. I know. She was wearing like a oops, we did it again shirt, I think, and I was walking with my cooler or something. Mm -hmm. and I don't remember like my actual like reaction, like watching the video, but like I could see, I could see her surprise, see like a didn't seem like he was jumping for joy type thing. Yeah, it didn't seem like that. Did you watch the one of the when I found out about Cece? Uh -uh. No. Oh, okay. Is it totally different? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Because uh, Bella was in the crib and it had an eviction notice on the. Oh, yeah, I think you crib. told me about it. Yeah, I never saw it mm -hmm. though. Yeah, I picked up Bella and spun her around and whatnot. This time it was just me and Shanann and she was in the kitchen. I don't know, like, I don't forget what date it was, maybe like June 3rd or 5th or 7th. I'm not sure, like, what date it was the video, but maybe I already felt guilty about. Talking to Nikki at work. Yeah. Maybe I, maybe that was going through my head. Is that the potential timing? Does that make sense? Okay. I don't remember the video, what day the video was, but I knew like I'd kind of met Nikki on like June first. Mm -hmm. I knew like the she told me like afterwards. When you say met her, you mean like went on a date with her? No, no, I never went on a date with her until she was in North Carolina. Oh, okay. Just like flirting stuff. Yeah, I mean, there was natural flirting back back and forth, and I was just like, I just, I knew that, like, with that video timing, I probably just looked like I was, like, felt guilty for even talking to the girl at work. Well, you probably did, right? Yeah. Did you guys fight before, you and Shanann? I know you talked about, like, not really raising your voice and stuff. Was there, because I want to say, didn't a neighbor talk about them fighting and stuff? Yeah, but that was, that was embellished and exaggerated and he retracted that. So oh, he ended yeah, up he, doing yeah, that? He that so. Did you guys ever fight? Did you ever... No, I mean, have, was, was there any domestic violence in your house? Like, no, like we never... This is strange to us to Even have... Even from her to you, I mean... Yeah. She gets no. mad when she's pregnant and grabs a knife or... No, like... Scratches you or smacks you around or nothing? No, she's never, like, nothing. Okay. That's what makes all this even more hard to understand from my standpoint and from yours, too. Yeah. Did she ever belittle you at all? Did you ever feel that way, maybe? What was that? Did, you, did she ever make you feel like she belittled you or you felt belittled by her? I mean, there's always points, like, in, in a marriage where, like, you know, the dominant person, like, you know, takes control of sure. everything. But, like, you know, I was just, my whole life, I just kind of went with the flow. Like, yeah, I never, I never, like, put myself in the center of attention I didn't want to be. Yeah. And I just kind of, I just wanted to be in the back row. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it was, if she did belittle me, I couldn't pick a point, pick an exact point or time. She never really felt that way. But no, I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I always knew I was like, you know, the introvert, and she was the, she, you right. know, she took control of most situations. Like when people came over, like you know, I knew what I, <laughs> how cool <goal> was. <laughs> yeah. Like I watch videos of like, like cooking, you know, or she'd make like power balls, or you know, or like uh, protein balls, or whatever. Yeah. You just don't seem like you want to be in those videos. No. Like you feel, I feel like you were being forced to be in those videos. And correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah, that's I, what I, it seemed well, like to me. I hated being in videos. I hated. I mean, I did it because for her, because right. it was for for her business and sure. stuff. But like it was, you know, I 
I did I hated just being out yeah. for everybody to see. That's why like the whole like the gender reveal thing, I was just like, hmm, I, I didn't want it to be like some live Facebook video. I'm just like, no. <laughs> But like I just I never wanted to be out there. Yeah, I know I'm like. Well, even when she was, because we talk about this a lot, Tammy and I and Dave. Even when it was, you know, I think it was Florida on some Lavelle or Thrive thing, and she's like, "Here we are," and it's all expenses paid. And oh, I was like, I remember looking at you and thinking like, he is not into this video right now. No, you don't look into any of the videos. I'll be honest with you. I wouldn't be either. Yeah. yeah it's not me. Yeah, I, I, get it. I mean, I remember you talking about like she would even post stuff for you, like because oh, yeah. you're technically a salesman too of yeah, was, Lavelle of yeah, Thrive. Cause, like she put me underneath her, and that like anything like any of my friends or stuff, like anything I do would help her. Right. So it was just you know, I would send her pictures. Like like I'd say, I take a picture with your patch. I'm like okay, send it to her, and then she'd make a post about it. She would. She eventually. She was like, "I need to take more control over like your business and stuff." I'm just like, "I don't know what to talk about." Right. Like if I went up to talk about talk to somebody at the mall or at the pool or somebody about this, I just stumble all over my words and just like they'd be like, "Okay, bye." But no. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not the salesman. Jesus, she's. I mean, she could sell everything you're wearing back to you. Right. <laughs> and you wouldn't even know it. Like, wait, I just paid. Right. For this shirt, I paid twenty bucks for it. Yeah, it's, those videos were not me. I just I did it just, just to support her. You know, like she would always say, "Oh." Could hey. you tell her no? Could you say, "I don't want to be in that video," or was that an option? Probably not an option. Yeah. I mean, it's like you know, she would have been like, well, "What? This is to you know help our family. This is for you know to help this and that." You know, so I couldn't have told her no. I mean, it would just it would have made her mad. I would have been like, "No." I would I wouldn't want to start that just because it's for the business it's for the family you know i was just going to try to help out wherever we can right did that actually make money mm -hmm. so not only just more sales but it actually put money in your guys pocket mm -hmm. okay and yeah, she made probably probably in that last year probably as much as i did on commissions basically i mean i know that's a simplified version of it but yep i mean it's uh and they don't take taxes out on it so yeah. right that, that was like the good thing, and they paid for your car. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, did they give you an allowance, her an allowance or something mm -hmm. to buy a car? Yep, yeah, if you if you're a certain level, like a 12k or above, they give you a car allowance once a month. Hmm. I'm not sure how they how they made money. The owners doing that, but they did. Yeah, unless there's just like an insane markup on the product, which I probably think there is. Probably is, yeah. I'm not sure how much much it costs for them to make it. Yeah. Did you feel like a different person wearing those patches? Especially like the the duo, the burn. I, I mean, the, it felt. I mean, like the Apple watches. Like if you look on it, like when it tells you to exercise, it says mm -hmm. I was exercising like all day because my heart rate was like up. Oh. Mm -hmm. Just from those patches. Was it full of caffeine or what? Uh, they just have something. They had something on. I mean, I had, the black label ones, the, the longer black ones, they, those had caffeine in them, but it never had that effect. And, I mean, the duo burn ones, the ones that are more of like the fat loss type, it was, I could, it felt like I was working out all day, even were, though I wasn't. Oh, were you tired? I mean, I know at some points, I, I mean, even Nikki said that, like, you know, I'd fall asleep on the couch, oh. on her couch, while I was talking to her. And then like pick back up like I was like I never knew I fell asleep, mm -hmm. which I don't know if it was like some insomnia thing or what, but like I was huh. I wasn't sleeping much. Right? Mm -hmm. We had a lot going on then. Yeah, yeah, but those were the only patches I really felt like a real big difference on, just because it felt like I felt like I was working out all day. Mm -hmm. You don't feel like they changed your personality or anything like that, though, or do you? I don't. Know. I don't really know. I know I just felt different on those than any other patch. It was, but like I could just go longer and longer each day. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure like if that was probably, that was probably a bad thing. Because I, I don't think I was probably sleeping more than three hours a night. Mm 